And now, Sports Line. Luke Flowers scrambles, pulls his own number, and reaches the goal line. The Rigby Trojans remain the kings of 5A. The Sportsline High School Football Preview Series begins today with one of East Idaho's premier squads, the Rigby Trojans. Rigby has won three of the last four titles in 5A, and the Trojans try to keep their dynasty going this year. A fourth quarter comeback at last year's 5A championship game led Rigby to back-to-back -to -back state titles and the Trojans third in four years. With a target still squarely on its back, Rigby chases its first ever three-peat in 2023. The kids know our standard. Um, I think the expectations um, are put on us by people on the outside, but we know what we have to do every year, and that's beat the team up north, win our district, and win one in the playoffs. And if we feel if we do that, then, then we've got a chance to kind of make a good run. We want to make sure we take care of those things. Um, um, that we can control in the season. And then at, by that time in November, you know, it, that's a long season. Stamina plays into it. And um, in the teams that, that are, have the most um, kind of physical and mental stamina at that stage, usually are the ones that make the run. And that's where we want to be. The message to the team from head coach Armando Gonzalez this year is simple. We are who we are. And, um, and, and you've inherited uh, something that others have built before you. And um, there's something special about that. And so now it's maintaining that legacy um, and carrying on the tradition. The Trojans return a wealth of talent on both sides of the ball, including quarterback Luke Flowers, who announced his commitment to Montana in June. He really, I think, um, uh, played above our expectations last year as a junior, um, and especially as the season went on. So I, I just, I'm just looking at him to be consistent and, and build on, on what he did, especially in that playoff run. I think he threw for close to 1,500 yards just in the playoffs. It's, uh, you know, and so um, I, I think just consistency every day and being able to, to, to do the little things out here in practice and not get complacent and think, well, I've done this before, so it'll be, it'll be fine. No, uh, all of these guys know it just won't happen. They have to make sure they, they take care of uh, their responsibilities and do their job. Early on, I mean, we're going to be tested. you got Coeur d'Alene, Lehigh, and American Fork, so I think after three games we'll know who we are. You heard it there from Armando Gonzalez. Rigby, as always, has a tough schedule, starting with a battle against Coeur d'Alene next Friday at the University of Montana. That's all for sports. I'm Eric Moon.